Hey everyone, it's Arrow Dragon, and welcome back to Let's Play Bug Fables! In the last episode, we got a couple of quests done, and got here to the Chomper Caves. And also we bought a house. In this episode, what's how's about we explore this area, shall we? Yes. Anyway, this is a completely optional area, you don't have to come here, but there is a couple there are a couple of reasons you want to come here. I also want to test a theory of mine. Does the Bug Me Not badge affect affect just the enemy in the field or does it take into account all enemies? It does take into account all enemies, so if I'm hunting for a golden seedling, I know how. But that'll be it later. I, I I figured out a better way. Anyways. Ice fall! Bang! <laughs> Man, those guys need to chill, am I right? Don't roll your eyes at me. Okay. And I shall do nothing, so it just stays frozen and doesn't attack me. Because again, these things are pests. <laughs> nice. Okay, I just need to survive one more turn from it. Nice! <laughs> 13 more points for me! One more battle like that. A crunchy leaf and... what's this? A frost pie! I'll just use this. That way I can just take it. <laughs> oh, that's interesting. I didn't think an enemy could drop a cooked item. And that's that! Rank up! And I'm gonna raise MP on this one. Leaf Learn Cleanse! Pretty sure that gets rid of negative status conditions, right? Actually, no, removes all temporary charges and status effects from an enemy. Interesting. I never know when that'll be useful. Speaking of which, I just, for I just remembered I forgot to re equip spy specs from before. Alright, I still have three left when I want. I'll do for now. Okay, this we can't do right now, but remember this area for later. Okay, he's gonna freeze in order to deal with you. Aha! Okay, I'm pretty sure I have to put and take a bit of a staircase, right? Uh, no? Hmm. Oh wait, I think I get the idea. Look to the left. That should be fine, I think. Perfect. The things you can get by accident just by fiddling around. I don't want to deal with you because I want to stay in pristine shape. Because we got something scary up ahead. Anyway, I can't do anything about that, so let's keep moving. I know there's a Venus butt up ahead, but I'd rather not waste my berries if I don't have to, even if I do have a lot. Is 
something here, but we're gonna have to fight for it. Everybody, say hello to the Mother Chomper. Eep! I almost got eaten! This thing ain't messing around! She keeps spitting chompers out. I think I'm gonna be your up first. Yeah, Dash Through is gonna be your best friend in this fight. Fortunately, she doesn't have defense, which is weird. But yeah, Dash Through being able to hit everything is, gonna, is an incredible boon. Just don't panic in this fight. That's, that's the best advice I can give. Don't panic. Keep her cool, take things as they come. Nice, I got an idea. This is a good time to show off charge up. Charge! Up! And remember, it can stack. Charge up! Oh, 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 that's convenient. Ah. Mm. All right, you asked for it. Charge up! Max power! Lots of damage. But well, I did deplete all my all my TP, but that's fine. I, I got crispy donuts. Should should I eat them? That's a sleep attack. Okay. Okay, I, th I think I think it's constantly attack. Oh, that was okay. Uh, yeah, we should, probably should focus on her. I got an idea. A crispy donut. Just make another one, and make another one of these when I get, when I get to the Defiant Root. Frigid Coffin! Nope. Oh well. Okay, new idea. Charge! Up! Charge! Up! How much do I need? Okay, good. Okay, no, I can't I can't do a third. Unless I use an item, which honestly wouldn't be a terrible idea right now. I'll use my honey pancakes. Charge up! Now, now for the reason I did it all charge up, this tornado toss is incredibly potent if you if you if you get a boost. Watch. Just look at all that damage. That was fourteen. Okay. I'm gonna use my honeyed leaf up. That way I can dash through. And also get leaf out of the red. Uh oh. Nice. Very nice. Okay, so what up to actions? Okay, I'm gonna... Okay, I can't do an ice fall. Hmm. That's an idea. I was originally gonna have Kabo attack the one in the back, but that's no longer needed. Okay, 
need to, I need to, I need to, I need to win this fast. Got an idea. Actually, no, I, sh I should keep eye in front. Tornado! Toss! Good, good. It's a good thing she has no defense. That means I can take. It means I can take her out right now. Nice. Now all you gotta do is take care of the baby. See, like I said, not not an especially hard fight. Just don't get. Just don't go into a frenzy. Just don't start to panic. Take things as they come, and you can get through just fine. Metal equipped. Oh, I didn't! Almost like I'm gonna have to go to the hive and do that, but fortunately I have to go there anyway. A chopper seed. Maybe a scientist will know what to do with this. Indeed, a scientist will. And it's a good thing we need to go to the fight route anyway for a few things, so I will see you guys at the. I'll see you guys at the hive after I heal up. Okay, we're here at the hive, and let's go see HB. I'm busy! Shoo! Shoo! <coughs> we should go before we make her faint. Wait, what's that? Uh, what? Dad, hand it over! <laughs> Wait, I wanna try, I wanna try the... <laughs> yeah, that, that seed we got. Oh, <laughs> that chomper seed. Only Hawk was here to examine it. He's still in the desert. What's taking him so long? Go after him! Dang it. Okay, but before I do that, I want to mention, I went and bought the metal I would have gotten for beating that on hard mode. I completely forgot I just, I just didn't engage that. Anyways, uh, the TP core metal is actually really good. Honestly, a yeah, strong star is getting weaker and weaker, so I'm going to equip that. And also, while I was in town, I picked up uh, the poison needles metal. Let's see if I can equip that. I can probably take off these two and the bug me not. So yeah, I can equip it no problem. So yeah, give, giving vice needle attacks the capability to poison is great. Anyways, just gotta go run a couple of errands in Defiant Root, and that's all I wanted. It's gotta run a quick errand in Defiant Root, and then we can go see the mayor like we're supposed to. Yeah, there's something I want to try, because an enemy dropped an aphid egg while I was on, uh, on the way back. And also, and also I deposited my, 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 my berries while I was in town. Okay, so that's what that's the first that's the first order of business. Second order of business is I want to see what happens if I combine an aphid egg with, with with a bag of flour. The sweet pudding, six HP and six TP, not bad, not bad at all. All right, now let's go see the mayor. I'm gonna keep an empty spot in my inventory because you never know when it might be useful. Ah, Kabu, good to see you! Del Delightless filled me in. No, it's my pleasure. Thank you for everything. Oh, ho, 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 don't think of it! You got info on the sand castle, correct? That I do! The castle's an ancient road structure, rumored to be at the northeastern corner of the Lost Sands. Mind you, that rumor's older than I am, but there is a weird tablet in the part of that desert. It's the only clue we have, so... Any ideas how to get in? Well, Scott will say you need the Heaven and Earth Keys to enter the castle. I've got a lead on only one of them. It's said to be with the bandits. They could cause us enough trouble as is. Ask around town. Someone could have a clue on their hideout's whereabouts. Maybe some have heard of the other key then. Unless that wasn't lying, time is of the essence. It's time to search. Stay safe, you three. The sands are unforgiving to those unprepared. Trust me, I know. I have my team. Worry not. We'll protect each other. 
I have no doubt. Even so, you've got to accept this little gift from the good old mayor. Forty-five berries! Nice! Mayor, this is too much! Take it, Kabu! You can't say no! Thank you, Mayor. You'll return safely. Anyways, got a couple of areas of points of interest. Hmm, no one's around here? I wonder. Hello. Word spreads quick. You're looking for the ancient keys? Maybe I can help you. For 30 berries, that is. Hmm. Let's just do it. You're wise, but Got the rusty key! An old rusty key! It seems to unlock a crooked place. Um, what's this? The key? The bandits look in the southeast of the desert. That's your ticket in. Just how do you have this? Well, no matter. We best start planning our trip there. Let's see... Yeah, I'm, good. I'm doing good on items. And I know exactly where that, that area is. Yeah, I remember that someone being near that well, and now they're no longer near the well. So that was suspicious to me. Anyways, while we're in the Lost Sands, there's a cup. Oh, that's not the right way. One head south. Anyways, there's a few things I want to check out while we're while we're out here. I'm gonna equip Bug Man now, just just to be on the safe side. I'm not gonna need this if I'm not gonna get into battles. Okay, now I know that's not an issue. Thank you. Let's see. Go that way. Oh, Dash can get to cut grass. I didn't know that. Something around here. I don't know where that something is, though. Would it be? Up. Oh. That's annoying. Does not need crazy print? Does not need crazy prepared too? Okay. Guess I'll find out later. <laughs> okay, I want to head to the west if I'm able to. No, I'm not. Maybe I am? No, I'm not. Okay, you can't break that. You can't get over that. That arrow worm followed me in, what? the way I'm thinking of? Not quite. That's something di That's something completely different. Not sure why there's an underling here. Okay, can't do anything about that, so... Okay, I can't, I can't find out what I wanted to find out. That's disappointing. Being on oh wait, what's this? Oh, it's just this. Hmm. Anyways, let's just head to where we actually need to go. Doing fine on stash, just missing some HP, which is not exa exactly the end of the world. This is the place. Open sesame. This is indeed the bandit hideout. That was super easy! Something feels off, doesn't it? It definitely is too quiet in here. Go figure. We got him! We got him! These are the ones the lost want, aren't they? Shove them in the dungeon! Take their stuff! We eat as kings tonight! <laughs> and that's just plain rude.
We were careless. I took my beam ring! Our, all our belongings as well. What a disgrace. Should have been more aware. Put you both in danger. Stop being melodramatic. Let's just look around. We'll figure something out. Hook up, Kabu. You can't let Vi beat be you at pep talks. You're right. You two really are a great team. Let's search every nook and cranny. This sounds really well sealed. Doesn't seem like our ice magic will help either. At least there's water to drink. Um, you okay there? I've got an idea! Vi, leave! Humor me one moment! Not much else to do, really. This is soft soil. I could dig us out of here! Can you really? Sounds pretty time consuming. You should know beetles are fantastic diggers! If you stick with me, we'll be out in no time! Uh, is this the only way? My fur's gonna get all dirty! You could stay here and starve, Vi. Alright, let's dig it up. Wonderful. Remember, if we are on a soft spot with soft dirt, I could dig by holding B. This will let us go under certain objects and hide from enemies. Say, how come we never brought this up? We didn't really need it, did we? All that matters is we're getting out of this cell. But we're gonna get our stuff too. Yes, this is one of this is one of the most important also under strike. I'm gonna check that real quick. Okay, they didn't take our medals weirdly. I think our too. Yes. <laughs> okay, so anyways. That's not, wait, that's not it. Understrike. Dig under enemies, hitting them with a powerful flipping, piercing, powerful flipping, piercing strike. It can hit any enemy that's on the ground, and it's incredibly powerful. And also, this is one of this is one of the best abilities in the game. If you've noticed mounds of dirt, like this one over here, this is actually a perfect example. What? The cursed bandits burying a poor bug alive like that! Actually, we think she's just asleep. Oh, should we wake her? Um, hello, fellow bug? Maybe we should just let her sleep. Ah, wake up already! Come on! Ah! Ah! Don't eat me! I don't actually taste like cherries! We won't hurt you. Just calm down, please. We might give you a hug, though. Uh, okay, my name's Cerise. Okay, what the heck are you doing underground? I came to this weird land looking for my boyfriend, Tanji. But I got really sleepy, so I dug a hole to take a nap in. And the monsters can't see you if you can't, see, you can't see them, you know? That's not how it works, but alright. Weird, I thought you were a prisoner, too. What's a prisoner? Oh no, she's not too smart. I also found this weirdly shiny berry while digging. Doesn't taste very good, though. You can have it if you want, Uncle Iron Seed. A crystal berry! Nice! Uncle Iron... What? Uncle Iron Seed. Because you look like an Iron Seed. You look old enough to be my uncle. <laughs> <laughs> but you don't actually look strong enough to have to eat lots of Iron Seeds, though. We should get going. Okay, love you. <laughs> I'll go outside and look for Tangy in a little bit, so don't worry about me. We won't. Too much. And honestly, I think that's a pretty good place to call the episode, because I'm at 31 minutes. I don't know how much of my errands going to be cut out. Anyways, next time on Let's Play Bug Fables, we'll be getting on escaping from the bandit's hideout. See you guys next time. Take care.